right guys, me and Johnny are headed into a new piece of public today. It's 2019 now, winter bow has started. Um, we normally hunt a few areas that have uh, locally grown beans on the federal and public lands, but this year they've been blown out by gun hunters and we scattered it and it's just not looking good. So we're gonna take a little bit and uh, scout a few different areas. Um, I have two in mind right now. We're about to go deep down into a bowl where I actually shot a buck a few years ago. Um, but it's a completely new area adjacent to that. Come along with us. It's me and Johnny today with BTM Bow Hunting. And uh, you know us, man, public land. So let's get it done, man. Let's go check this stuff out. Let's mark a few things on the maps, and then hopefully we can make a game plan together. I got a whole sack of milkweed with me, so I'm planning maybe if we could get um, a good setup, maybe get a nice ground hunting setup. I've killed many deer from the ground. I'm really have to dial in, so let's get out there and let's find some sign. Jeez, the horn hunter packs. Hold on, Johnny. Got more things. Sick of beanie. Lock for the camera. And we are ready to go. Let me shut this off so I can shut this and we can get out of here. Just kick some deer up. We are going to scout another bedding area on the back side of this hill which is just the same elevation line as uh, as I killed a buck on just a couple miles down. The way it runs, it all works. And uh, we came up upon this bluff and I had Johnny with his bow over there. And now I'm slowly working back towards him, trying to push these does back over there. Maybe we could fill the freezer with one, so stay tuned. If not, we're about to work our way back to an old uh, faithful spot. We're gonna take a little seat on the ground, play the wind right, and then hopefully connect. So we'll catch back with you. All right. We posted up back by this bedding area that we scouted earlier this season, but hunted the opposite side, not as far down as this. Got the birdie. We just set up another camera, another Moultrie cam. Um, put a little lock on it. We're basically just watching this transition line into the bedding area from open broken timber. There's a couple big pylons and stuff like that, but it looks real good. So but me and Birdie are about to go head out, back to the truck, move, and go hunt for the rest of the evening. So we'll check back in with you. All right, we're all set up now. We actually pulled out the ground blind out of the truck because we found a perfect location for it. So it's me and the bird. Got the, got the little ghetto ground blind set up, but I put a bunch of uh, addictive sweet corn spray in front of the ghetto. Uh, blind about 30 yards 30 35 yards so we're gonna see what's up we we're actually just gonna sit on these chairs and just on a nice falling down tree pile on but we brought the blind with us just in case this happened we literally found a couple trails that connect they all lead towards um, ag fields feed there's an oak flat in front of us about 300 yards that they usually work through straight back to their p.m. evening feeding so I actually just heard something, so we're gonna sign off here. Well, it's about 4.30. We haven't seen one deer. We thought we might have seen one doe 200 yards away on a ridge, but it could have been a bear. I don't know what I was looking at. We have about 15 minutes left of solid light. We'll see what happens, but. Hopefully next time we come out here we could draw one early because we did see a lot of deer today. We did see a lot of hot sign, which is unusual for this time of the year. So a lot of hot condensed sign, so which is really good, awesome to find on public land during January. So we'll be at it all year. All right, guys, we're back at the house now. Me and Johnny overall had a very slow sit tonight. We didn't see any deer at all. We did kick up four or five does as we were scouting by a thicket. We did hang a camera over there. So next video, we might check that camera, show it to you guys, see what we got on camera. Uh, until next sit, though, we don't know where exactly we're going to sit. We're definitely going to go to the same area. A lot less gun pressure than all the other pieces that we scouted. Uh, yeah. We're going to keep at it. I hope you guys follow BTM Bow Hunting. Follow us on Instagram at BTM underscore bow hunting. 
Uh, we post a lot there, mostly daily. I try to get uh, daily pictures out, daily stories when we're out in the timber. Listen to that, check out our Instagram, and uh, we will have more footage for you guys shortly. Hopefully we can lay down some deer for you in winter bow season, but we will definitely have a lot of content for you coming up in 2019.